Hello, this is Breakfast with Steph McGovern. The Queen pays tribute to the people of London and Manchester after this year's terror attacks. Good morning, Merry Christmas. It's Monday the 25th of December, also ahead this morning. The pool... Oh, some brilliant memories there. If you've got any as well you want to share with us, do get in touch. And I'm sure Phil's got a few as well. Phil, are you outside your house there this morning? <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. No, this, in fact, I'll give the, the, the credit where it is due. Uh, this is uh, Carla's garden. Well, that's who sent the picture in. I... How does it? Uh, it might be. Deepest winter at home, but of course, for England's cricketers, they'll be stepping out into the summer sunshine in Australia later today for the first session on the next Ashes Test. Now, of course, they've already lost... Now, if you're relaxing at home, perhaps opening presents this morning, you might have already done it, to be honest. Uh, spare a thought for this team, who are still hard at work. Oh, it's Santa. And... Now, it's going to be a busy day for the Royal Family today. They'll shortly be making uh, the walk across from... Uh, their estate to St Mary Magdalene Church on the Sandringham Estate. Our Royal Correspondent, Daniela Ralph, is there for us this morning. Good... It'll be great pleasure to announce our special guest here tonight, the BBC presenters, Naga Manchetti. <laughs> Mike Bushel. <laughs> Louise Minchin. Dan Moore. <laughs> and Charlie Stegg. Hold on to your hats, everyone. Here we go. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Yuletide carols being sung by a choir. And folks dressed up like Eskimos.
Did she do well? Oh, she did brilliantly. Oh, she did. I'm so proud. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Uplifting. Get you right here. Right. I thought they were brilliant. They were up for a laugh, that's the main thing, isn't it? That's what you gotta do at Christmas, so yeah, it's good. They were so, you know, brave to do it. They really went for it, so it would be mean to cringe, wouldn't it? I really thought they did brilliantly. We got away with it, we got away with it. We had yeah. hit our bad notes. Yeah. They were so oh, kind to us. Oh, I'm, I'm going to give the audience 10 out of 10. Merry Christmas to you. I'm so sorry, Simba. I know that was awful. <laughs> One of our little Christmas dogs that's on the sofa. Thank you for all of your messages uh, you've sent in about uh, our singing. Do you want to get off, Simba? Go on, then. Uh, now, Jacqueline says, please don't take offence. Your singing is awful, but I love you all. As I'm sitting on my own, you've made me smile this morning. Oh. Thank you for everybody who's sent in messages, and uh, thank you for getting in touch. Mary Kinsella, enjoying the calm before the hustle and bustle of the day begins. The advice about how to keep calm was great. And, of course, giving that advice with our three wise men, we've also got Eddie the Eagle still on the <laughs> sofa with us this morning. And Grant's three little sausage dogs for us here on breakfast. Have a fabulous day.